Hey, let's take a look at the superpowers Wonder Woman. Um, I am glad they brought back superpowers, but to be completely honest with you, I was too old to get into superpowers when it came out the first time. I was like at that in-between phase where I was done with my first childhood and not ready for my second childhood. I remember when I was in high school, I was still a little bit on the side, you know, like Centurions and Transformers, but I remember I didn't say much about it in high school. I remember this kid named Dale in my art class. Uh, he's like a year younger than me, and he was always being teased about having toys. And I'm like, well, why don't you just like not tell anybody? He's like, going, why? I want to be true to myself and let them be damned. I mean, he was just like, he didn't really care what people think. I'm going, yeah, but you don't have friends and people pick on you. And it's like, I don't know. I just felt sorry for him because, you know, and I don't know. Um, so I don't know if he was into these or not, but hey, if you're out there, Dale, I'm sorry that I never really understood at the time. I was still trying to fit in myself. You know, it was it was a different time. Batwing, Supermobile. I got these two. So this is from, it's like it was Wave 2, I'm pretty sure, because I know um, they had a different Wonder Woman at first, and I don't think this was it, but I could be wrong. But they were on clearance at my Walmart for $2.50. So and they had this sticker over it, 5 or five inch Wonder Woman Superpower. I'm not sure what the sticker is there for. I hope I can peel it off successfully so I can keep the card. You know, that's doing that thing. I think it's a safety thing with a little aluminum whatever going on. So I don't know. I like to keep the cards sometimes. Especially with the biographies on them. Ooh, that's not going to go oh well. The, the artwork. Let's look at the artwork for a second. And then we can say, oh, well, it's going bye-bye. I'm sure there's other people out there who preserve this on the internet. You know, when I was a kid, I kept all my cards and stuff as long as I could until my mom found them. So she comes off the card without any weapons, not even a magic lasso, which is bummer. Um, I'm not sure what era this Wonder Woman is. She's got the longer silver gauntlets than what I'm used to as a child. I remember watching the Wonder Woman TV show. She's not quite the modern. She's got less of a bikini, so it's not the Baywatch era. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what era this is from, but um, it's definitely not the 80s Wonder Woman. So they're going kind of like a, making it like the 80s but making it modern. She's got a soft goods cape. I've heard people whine about these. I'm not sure why. This doesn't seem to be a bad thing to me. But then again, I don't have a lot of caped ones. I only have um, from the original, from what I've gotten so far. I have him because he was on sale for dirt cheap. I have him, I have it open. He's actually in here, I think. I think he's in my basket right beside me. Oh, and I need to get out these figures to prepare them too. Okay, maybe I'll just compare it to one. Okay, so I got this one at full price because I, I definitely wanted it. The other ones, I was like, eh, take them or leave them. So for articulation, she could do 360 degrees. Yeah, her hair is getting in the way of that. It looks like maybe people are complaining about the capes because there's a little bit of red here. And I would imagine it's stained from the cape because there's some more red right there. Unless she's, unless when I pulled her arm back, it gave her like, you know, Oh no, look, see, that maybe that's what people are complaining about. I thought they're complaining about the material. It's like not good. Hmm. What do you guys think? Should I leave the cape on and not worry about it? Because I guess the damage is done. And, or take the cape off. I don't even remember a Wonder Woman with a cape except one time in a picture of it. Linda Evans or whatever her name was did a picture. Her legs can go up. Which is cool because I got the invisible jet. I guess I should have the Wonder Woman for it. I was going to put my other Wonder Woman from the four inch line in from the, uh, what is it called? The uh, Spin Masters one. I was going to use it for her. She could bend 90 degrees. Th and I'm sorry, but wellhouse is on. I'm washing clothes. And, it, you know, it's, now it's in the rinse cycle probably. There. It just takes a few seconds because it has, it has to build up the pressure. It's not actually pumping the water out. It, well, anyway. It built up pressure for it to pump it out naturally. So that's her in a nutshell. Like I only want to do one thing with my videos other than give you articulation. I'm going to give you a full backstory or anything except why it's important to me because even if nobody ever watches this, at least it preserves my memories for my great grandchildren, I guess. I don't know. All right. So we have her beside of another um, similar scale, but much smaller. She's five inches. She's four and a half, four inches. She's one eight, eight, one eighteen scale. I don't know the scale of these. Are they one fifteen scale? Maybe. Yeah, I just know that for the longest time, 
I did have the Marvel Secret Wars, so I I don't think that was, I think that was out earlier. Comment below, or I'm probably gonna have to look it up if I can remember. But I don't think these ran at the same time. If they did, maybe I did have an opportunity to get them, but I can't remember having any of these figures when I was a kid. I, I just can't remember at all. Brainiac? No. Maybe I, maybe I had Brainiac. Anyway, so here it is beside this one. And then we have it beside of a, a, a knockoff G.I. Joe kind of thing. It's from a very prestigious company, though. Very good company. <laughs> he's, he's Steve Trevor going, wow, you are Wonder, Wonder Woman. All right. Thanks for watching. And uh, comment below if you know when did these originally come out. And just, just to remind me that I need to check out. Oh, you know what? These other languages aren't, it's, I thought it was going to be a long biography. It's just in English at the top, and the other ones are in different languages, so it's it's going to be okay. These were on the originals too, I'm pretty sure. Like Again, I didn't have it. I remember one of my friends got Green Lantern one time, and he was more excited about the ring than the actual figure, which was kind of funny. All right, y'all have a great day.